Hey everyone, Chris here again from Most Games, and welcome to, well, welcome back to, welcome to, you just welcome to, welcome to Eternal Darkness, Sanity's what, Requiem, Requiem, Void Dweem, uh, if you've, uh, if you've been sulking around the channel, uh, yeah. as people time to time do, uh, you may have noticed that this is not the first time this may have appeared on my channel. This wretched book uh, ultimately, because so long, uh, just a while back I, I started it with um, Turok 2007. It was one of the first videos I did I for the channel. And uh, at a certain point, I was borrowing the game, and uh, I, I no longer had access to it. So I was like, ah, well, I'll keep going. I'll finish up Turok, and, and someday I'll come back to it. And so this is me coming back to it someday. So this is... Gonna be pain in the butt, if I remember correctly, because I, I went through a lot of different parts of this game, and I don't remember any of it. And I remember being lost in the mansion for the first whole episode. So, um, while we're here, let's uh, let's cozy in for a, a midnight story of uh, murder and mayhem and possibly demons. Probably demons, based on the uh, the Necronomicon there. And uh, the, the better part about this is, though, um, I will have significantly better recording situations and uh, just a better setup in general because back then I was using a rock band mic and really outdated capture software so the the gameplay was flickery as far as I was concerned or stuttery and the the audio was echoey and really really bad so I'm very happy with the way oh we're already in this we're doing this now I, I got shotguns and I'm clearly. Oh no. Oh no. Uh. Your head. It's mine. Your head. It's mine. Oh. This isn't. Okay. Oh. That's not good. They. They get back up. That's your chest. Hold on. I gotta. That's not. Is there a run button? Please tell me there's a run button. I have a shuffle. That's my dance button. Yeah. Apparently, if I hit X enough, it goes to the next cutscene. I'm pretty okay with that. Yeah, darkness is coming. It's called Zombies About to Eat My Face. Ben? Is that you, Ben? Luke. Get out of here. No one wants you here. Run. Nah. But it was all a dream in the end. So yeah, so the recording situation is a lot better. I'm pretty happy about that. And I'm pretty happy that the quality will go up. I, I kind of considered going back and redoing Turok, but I think... For the most part, it's uh, it's done. I'm not gonna worry about it. Eternal Darkness just wasn't so much like Dark Souls, which uh, hopefully, unlike Dark Souls, it'll be finished. But I'm going to go back and kind of re-record it and kind of there's just a certain level of, of polish I'd like to have on on the channel. And I I thought the Eternal Darkness ones were kind of really bad, and it wasn't like the jokes or anything like that because let's face it, I didn't really tell jokes ah, I still don't know but I, I I wanted to make sure that um, it was a pleasant yes, listening to for um, people who wanted to go through the game with me so here we are we're going back through it it's a shame um, you have the worst case of jaw connected to sternum I've ever seen sir but I must warn you it's not a pleasant sight well most murder scenes aren't sir but I'll, I'll be the judge of that not much to see not much to see. Okay, that's good. Okay, let's let's go check this out. There's no way there's something bad around this corner. Oh, gee, what do you mean nothing to see? It's mostly a torso. God, why? Or a still frame drawing of people being zoomed in on. I, you know, I couldn't tell under all the sheets, but I can tell by his lumps that's definitely him. You know, I could have just put that ring on anybody, but you're very trustworthy. I appreciate that. Why are you showing me this? Can't you drink Why are you drinking your coffee so, so calmly? You rude bastard. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I just, I really don't, I don't, I don't pick up on social cues. I got a bad problem. There's no head. Oh God. Well, if if there's no head, how can I guarantee who he is? I have never seen anything like this in my 20 years. I've never force. seen just like a dead body. 20 years on the force. You believe me? This is the worst. Like, it, well, it really—it's the first murder I've seen. It's crazy. We don't have a it's unbelievable. So you better find out who did this. I am not leaving. Rhode or I'll do it myself. There must be some clue in this old mansion revealing what happened. 
I want my God. answers. So do I. I wish I had some. Well, it's not in the coffee cup, I'll tell you that much. Two weeks? I say two e Okay, fine. That's okay. Well, I'm going to read this like a local newsman. Shocked by a father's mysterious death and frustrated at the incompetence of the local police, Alex vows to uncover the truth. She decides to search the mansion, the place where Edward conducted his research. If there was a tie to his past and possibly a tie to his murder, it would be here. I'm Chuck Manley. Stay tuned for more coverage at 11. That was, oh god, that was actually an old bit I did last time, and I feel like it was still appropriate. Oh, yeah. Punch that air. You show him, Alex. Now let's get out of this mansion and never worry about it again. Is there, seriously, is there a run button? Seriously, I got a, I got a groove button, which is like, yeah, look at that. There's like a, a creep walk, and then like she stutters. Like that. Uh, the call of the mansion beckons to Alex, drawing her back to uncover the family secrets and hides. Alex will not leave until she has learned what happened to her grandfather. Well, thank God for that internal monologue. Oh, thank God, the L button. That's my run button. Good, good. Oh, I should probably look at this real quick. It's so dark. Dark and creepy. A beautiful carriage clock. The hand appears to be stuck, yet the clock continues to tick. With the time permanently, permanently set to 3.33. There is a key in the back of the clock, presumably for winding it, should Alex look at that key. Alex picks up the dresser clock, puts the key, pulls the key from it. I'm sorry, I've had too much schnapps to really continue reading this. It isn't for winding at all, it's for dressing yourself. I mean, it's a key to a dresser, dear sweet god. Well, time to go find me a sexy dresser. Figure out where to put this in. Start with up here, because there's only one door, and it seems like the door's locked. How do you use stuff? Okay. Equips. Seconds, okay. It, it, it's old school. Oh, look at that, second floor key. Okay, keep in mind, I haven't like done this in a long time. I, I did a quick check-in just to see how the audio was so I could remember. <sighs> this is why I shouldn't talk while I'm trying to open keys, to open doors with keys. It's broken. Perhaps there's some way. Over. Well, if, if I broke it, it clearly wasn't a very sturdy key. I might as well just burn the house down because I'm not getting upstairs again. And Alex has broken the key. The key must be repaired somehow. You, Alex. Always being silly and stuff. Okay, so let's uh, open this door. A lot of creepy mumblings going on right now. I am scared because I forget if this is actually a horror game or if this is like horror atmosphere with not so horror mechanics. I guess we're going to find out. Is there anything in this room I can actually see or do anything about? Because it feels like there's nothing I can do. You know what? For everyone's sake, I'm going to be... Okay, let's... Do I have... Oh boy. Options. Options. There we go. Display. Uh, brightness adjustment. Let's be cool with everyone so everyone can see what I'm doing. Oh, that's that might be too bright. A little washed out. Let's, let's go down a bit. Right there. Yeah, save and continue. Memory card day. Uh, also, I don't know which uh, which memory card my old save files on. So even if I wanted to go back, I can't. So we're all stuck doing it again, anyways. It's it's been a while. A wooden plaque is fastened to the to the door. I was going to say odor, and you can't fasten a wooden plaque to odor, but you can fasten odor to a wooden plaque. Um, the colorful, colorful sigil is covered carved. Wow, what is wrong with me? The colored sigil is carved into the wood above the wide slot. The slot is just wide enough to insert a narrow blade. Neat. Why use keys when we can use swords? Thanks, Granddad. You're the best. Open this door. Now I'm in the hallway. Now I'm in the dining room. Or the exploratory room. Or the murder room? The table is set for one. Alex's grandfather, Edward's private... Uh, why is Alex's grandfather a single sentence? Can someone can you please just correct that for me? Yeah. Yeah, now give him, give him like a... Give him like a needs more work kind of thing. Awesome. Thank you. Appreciate it. There we go. I think I can go through the rest of that sentence because I didn't try either. Detail. The grand piano stand here. 
Mm, let's let's try that one again. A grand piano stands here, waiting the hands of a decent musician. Unfortunately, Edward never really lived up to that description, and as such, the piano fell into disuse. No one really says things like that, but I appreciate the fact that we're using words that don't get a lot of use or have uh, disuse. Uh, Bill, I, I, don't, I really don't know how to use that word because it's it's silly. What can I examine? What do we got here? Details. The illustration features a collection of strange line designs related to each other in the cyclical manner. In a cyclical manner. Wow, I just realized I can't read. Like this is a, this is a problem. You know, you're a person that plays video games. You just don't know how to read. There appears to be some significance to it, but it isn't particularly particularly evident. I'm almost positive back in the day when I played this, I could read. So this is a new development after... How many years have I been doing this? Like five years? I think five years is when I started doing this game last. Probably six. This is unfortunate. Oh, the study. Look, now I can just get murdered here. Almost hit my head on that lamp as the camera. That was really dis disorienting, but I appreciate it. Examine. Good on you. Glad we could be part of this. Uh, grandfather clock. Oh, okay, okay, I do remember this. This is, um, yeah, you gotta adjust the clock hands to the one that was out there, which was 3.33. Ah, ah, yeah, there we go. See, everything's, everything's coming back to me. I'm not gonna be stuck here forever. That's for damn sure. I think, I swear there's more to do here, but... Yeah, it's probably down here anyways. I don't worry about it. That's okay. We're, we're, we're getting places. It's good. I'm gonna open this. My god. I opened a door and closed it. Now I'm terrified and in a place that looks super sketchy. My god. Is Grandpa a, a, a Nazi of some sort? What's with all the swastika paraphernalia? Oh, look, it's a sword. Probably for opening that door that I'm going to go open here in a little bit. Detail. A large leather-bound antique book. Could we have added any more adjectives to that? Rests upon the cluttered desk. Should Alex read the book? It's probably in, like, some dead language like Latin that no one learns anymore in school, so... It's probably not going to be able to get very far, but hopefully there's pictures. Alex likes pictures. So does Chris. Oh, God. Okay, you're a pretty Sarlacc pit. Oh, no. It's also part those worms from from uh, Mass Effect. Of what was to come, nor did I care. Yeah, it's all perfectly in English. Either that or I just have perfect dyslexia that lines up everything. As you read this. Because I'm assuming it's written in dyslexic code. Don't don't question what I was trying to do there. It's fine. I got this. understand. Understand the true power of the carnitas burritos. They're delicious, man, and they're only like four dollars. See beyond the veil of the chosen one. To see those who dwell behind. My life now has purpose. I found the true, the true cheesy gordita land. It's a Taco Bell on Forty Fourth and and Twelfth Street. It's pretty great. I'm not going to lie. Pretty happy about that. Where is Quies Candamast? Where is Conservandai? Facusatis Aqua. We'll go back to the orgy pits in the morning, but for now, you two. Degrease and get some rest. Is this Centurion? I do not doubt our Emperor's beliefs or his <laughs> orders. I mean, he believes in like a flying spaghetti monster, but you know what? He pays the bills. Let's not get too hard on him. Hail President Scroob. Pius Augustus. Man, do I have to? It's so far. I've been walking for like three minutes. It's so far. It's like half past that one rock over there. We ain't got wristwatch. What do you think we got? I mean, this seems pretty legit.
Oh no, the rocks have turned against me. I knew they'd work together to take me down. Oh no, they're granting me the power of lemons. And now I'm just disintegrated. Oh no, they, they warped me into Neocortex's room of levels. Let's see if I can go do Polar Pursuit real quick. Before something bad happens. Right, I got the run button. Sprint, 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 sprint. Is this one of those games where I can collect like more weapons and items, or is this a game where I'm just I'm just me? First of all, don't don't give me okay. Well, don't give me like a button, and then if I move, take away my my options. Just lock me in place. Hi, right, so you got nothing else going on? Go down the ladder. I don't like that thing. That thing looks like it's about to get back up. <laughs> all about to get back up. Oh look, it's the cube of Aldronon. It's a magical cube that when you stick it in your eyes, it blinds you because there's a cube in front of your eyes. It's really not magic, but we're a very superstitious folk. Hey, can I cut him now? Because I don't trust that guy. Uh, one of these guys is going to get up. One of these guys is going to get up. And you lost your head. You lost an arm. Hold on. Lost that arm. You done? You gonna stop? Finish him. That's awesome. Pretty great. Any more? You wanna get back up? I'll cut you. I'll cut you so bad. You wish I... Oh no! They're coming out of the shadows! Huh. 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 Run a little bit. Huh. Huh. I don't know... I don't remember this game being so silly and so simple. But it has been a bit. I'm sure this is, you know, because this is the beginning. It's probably not going to get too crazy. I'm going to take the the granite block. Sorry, I I thought my name was pretty good, so let's let's just stick with the block of Aldernon. You got a cool you got a cool symbol on it. And you're going to just call it the granite block? What's wrong with you people? Call it like the the cube of desolate doom and mayhem. Look, there's a there's a green one. Hold on. Stop it. Stop it. I, made, I hit the wrong button. That one's just gonna stand there. He doesn't remember where his, his keys are, let alone who his children were. Yeah, I know. You think I'm there, but I'm not. I'm also facing the wrong way, so let's try this again. Got your arm. Come over here. Stabby, stabby. Give me the dollars. Stabby, stabby. Five dollars. Ah, oh, you are we're ready just to hand. Oh, look, it's another granite block. Naming you the the block of childish Gambino. That's what it is. I don't even care. This is this is Romania. I don't even know where I am. <laughs> no, it just came in. Huh. Oh God, they're trying to surround me. Oh, they're trying to surround me. Just dance, dance, pious. Yeah, Mr. Augustus, get their heads. They don't know where you are if you take their heads. Hold on, hold on. We we got a heady over here. He thinks he knows what he's doing. I gotta cut him. Hold on, stab you in case you regenerate. I don't know how this thing works, but you guys are stupid. <laughs> you didn't even think about the possibility of me being able to move. I guess without a brain, you ain't that smart, are you? you dumb zombies. You zambos. That's right. Come here. And you, you've been swatting at nothing for about an hour now. I feel bad for you. <laughs> Just gonna put you out of your misery. And there we go. Who's my new friend? It's you. Yes, it is. Uh, that one. Strange granite block lies on the floor. Um, the the block of uh, Lando Calrissian. Oh, damn it! I already used that one. Uh, the block of <laughs> um uh. You know what? This one's mine. Pius Augustus. That's the block of the block of Pius, Mr. Augustus. Miss Augustus, if you're nasty, give me that. I sure hope these camera angles don't screw me in some way where I won't see the next thing coming to kill me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, go ahead. There's just a door. It's just a door, and I'm walking down a hallway in the worst camera scheme possible. This is why Resident Evil doesn't do this anymore. <laughs> it 
really messing with my my stuff. Oh, there's a purple block. I didn't get a purple. Oh, there's a purple. Okay, everyone, line up for head cuts. Not haircuts, head cuts. Because, really, <laughs> it makes this part super easy. That's right. Oh, I was like, did I get a two for? No, he just he just flinched at the right time. Okay, now let's try and trim off those limbs. Don't don't want any loose pieces. Don't worry, Pius knows what he's doing. He's a professional. He's been doing this for years. This is how he beat the Spartans. <laughs> or the Persians. Whichever people he's... Did you just beat your friend to death? Did you even... Uh, you didn't even... Try. You just beat him down. And now I have to stab him. I don't, I don't even feel good about that. I feel like I put in no effort. No work. Took all the fun away from it. Hey, can I get up here, please? Thank you. That's mine, that's mine, that's mine. Man, sure is a lot of B button I had to press. Could have been solved with one button press and just picked it up. That's fine. Uh, Alright, this is a game where I have to insert... Okay, inventory. No, not that one. I'm at blue, you fool. You inserted purple into blue. Yeah, that, that you, you, you're stupid. You know your colors. How old are you? This is rated M for mature. You're gonna tell me you don't know your colors? God, you're so dumb. Sure as hell don't know how to go into a a menu, even though you have to do this in order to actually proceed in the game. Fine, I understand. It's kind of weird, a little gimmicky. God, and you still keep going up to these places and you still don't use the use button initially. The last one, that's the one I'm gonna get. The purple one. I feel like I can handle it this time. Start. Use. Oh look, dummy, you didn't do it this time. Good job, you dumb. Well, let's just say I'm not going to call you what I want to call you, but you're a dumb one. That's for sure. You're a dumb one of it. Da 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 da. And then da 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 da. No zombies down these hallways. There seems to be a stoned man. I mean, a man made of stone. He looks an awful lot like me. Have I already been worshipped as a god by these zombies? Because pressing R will never pious to select which target to attack. Uh, cool. Uh, releasing R slightly and then pressing again will cycle between that. Bias can attack special. Uh, yeah, I've, yeah, I've been, I've been doing that. Because if I didn't, I wouldn't have gotten this far without being touched. Hello. Yeah, I want to fight him. Let me fight him. Can I fight him? And your arm. Your arm, your head, torso. Now give me your milkshake. Stoned Pyrus. Pyrus, wow. Oh boy. Okay, let's. <laughs> You're cuddly. Excuse me? And then, hold on, the lock on isn't the best. It doesn't, doesn't pick close, it picks facing. <laughs> That's okay. Chris is gonna make it through this. Chris is gonna stab you, stab you in your pretty little arms. I want the, the other arm. Stop, stop. Boys, boys, your mother wouldn't like to see you writhing on the ground like this. Let, let Papa Pius stab you. <laughs> Papias. It's almost like Papyrus, or Papayas. Either way, I mean, you know, you either get a cool skeleton or like a fruit, and everybody's happy with that. I know I would be. Am I done yet? Did I win? Is the game over? Examine. I wonder if I should touch this glowing thing. It's a button. Yeah, push the button, Papyrus. There's no chance you're gonna catch its flames. Oh no, now the rocks are back. They're gonna fight you. You totally messed up. They're gonna eat your face. Oh no, why are you walking in? That's what they want you to do, Papyrus. Papyrus? Papaya man? Papaya Armstrong? Oh no! There's different ones. I I like the color blue. But the color green also looks good. I think I picked green last time. It's also red. You know what? Let's let's uh let's, let's, oh god, there's so many options. Ah, oh, jeez, ah. Oh. Uh you know what? We'll pick next time on the on the next episode. Take that! See you guys next time.